for the skin sample preparation, we will first dissect a rat to extract the skin. We will need a cutting board, a rat, a tweezers, scalpel, a styrofoam board, and needles. If the rat is frozen, partially defrost for two hours in the refrigerator to facilitate manipulations. Lay the rat so that its back is fully exposed. Don't forget to clean any blood on the skin. Using a scalpel and tweezers, cut a rectangular region of the back. Now, using tweezers, carefully remove the skin from the back while cutting with a scalpel. Avoid keeping muscle and fat on the skin. Lay the rectangular shaped skin on a styrofoam board, hair facing down. Secure the sample by using needles. Now, remove the tissue layer beneath the dermis. If the testing procedures are not performed on the same day of the dissection, note that the rectangular shaped skin can be stored at minus 20 degrees and then thawed at 4 degrees for at least 45 minutes before placing the skin sample on the cutting board. To prepare dog bone shaped skin samples, we will be using a cutting board, rat skin, a mallet, razor blade, a cutting die with utility blades installed, a cutting template, and tweezers. Place the skin on the cutting board. Using the cutting template, cut a rectangular section of skin by firmly holding the razor blade while using the mallet. Then, center the cutting die on the skin to make the middle cut. Firmly hold the cutting die in place and use the mallet to cut through the skin. Use a sufficient force to cut the entire section. Now position the razor blade to obtain a dog bone shaped and then slightly tap the razor blade with the mallet to facilitate incision. Repeat this operation for the four diagonal cuts. Now that you have your dog bone shaped skin sample, place it in a delicate task wipe soaked in PBS to preserve the moisture until testing.